you have higher enrollment coming at the school, you're looking to move to a new facility. Uh, one more thing I want to touch on is just how you might be collaborating with businesses because we have a lot of Fortune 500 companies here. We mentioned General Motors and Quicken Loans mm -hmm. earlier. Could you talk a little bit about how the school works with those businesses and maybe some others I'm not thinking of? Yeah, we um, we have a couple different ways of working with businesses. One 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 of, one of which is um, to, to produce the best product we can for them. I mean, our, our students are our product, and and getting them internships, getting them um, permanent placements with with the, with the wonderful businesses in and around the city of Detroit. Um, you know, about 85 percent of our students come from Southeast Michigan, and you know, almost all of them don't want to leave Southeast Michigan. And so, so that's great. They come, they they come here and they stay. <clears throat> we also work a lot with businesses in our classrooms. There, they can they can pr uh, bring in context and provide material in our in our classes that will help their students be better prepared for the job market. That point you just mentioned about students wanting to stay in Michigan. I bet a lot of people come to you who are in you know maybe the political world or public policy and say, how do we stop the brain drain? And maybe this is how, where, where you have a degree program that's funneling into jobs for a lot of people right downtown. Right. Yeah, you know, it's um, unlike a lot of other universities, unlike a lot of universities even in, in the uh, metro Detroit area, I mean, there's, uh, you know, about 90-some percent, 95 percent of our students stay in the state of Michigan. And then about, as I said, 85 percent stay in southeast Michigan. So it's, uh, uh, at least with regard to Wayne State, there isn't much in the way of a brain drain. Wayne State's a retention pond. It's a retention point.